Well, good evening, people of the tube. Um, do you know, I, I really should stop saying that. I'm going to sound like one of those fucking YouTubers then who've got like cliched catchphrases and stuff, which I don't want to be. That's just not me at all. Uh, so good evening, chicken bummers and uh, three legged jippos dogs alike. This is my first initial look at the gate. Uh, gate. Uh, I'm not looking at any gates at the moment. But what I am looking at is a game. Alien Isolation. I've literally started the game and then stopped it in order to get the update file uh, installed. It's an 845 megabyte file for those who care about those kind of little bits of information that uh, people have um, needed before I could uh, play. And, well, I guess I could have played it without updating it, but I, I figured perhaps the update was to fix something that perhaps they found. And, you know, since it got went gold and got produced in the factory, they found that, uh, you know, something's gone wrong so i'd rather play it fully updated i'm going to play it offline so there's no interruptions you don't get any of those little messages up in the top of the corner of the screen stuff like that um i should also uh what i'll do as well is uh because this has happened to me before uh i've been recording something and all of a sudden then somebody's been fucking phoning me asking me why i'm not online and and things like that and oh what's the game like you know, I I, I want to play it without having to juggle various different forms of media. So I'm going to press start now. And this is literally going to be me seeing this for the first time. This is a first impressions. This is a one of my sort of one man rambles where I'll just go on and on and on. I don't script anything. It's not pre written. Uh, you know, I don't rehearse stuff it's in at the deep end this is your bargain bin uh kind of youtube channel it's a sort of tesco value then shall we say uh youtube channel if you want to have a youtube or you want to see a video that's got fancy graphics and all thumbnails that look exactly the same as they do uh i i don't know what else to say to you find somebody else i'm not that type um this is my channel this is how i do things and this is me pressing play for the first time, if the game needs subtitles, if the volume isn't recorded very loudly, I'll apologise in advance. But um, I'll go into the, when, when I get a chance to go to the options screen, I will put subtitles on for those with hard of hearing or whatever. Very green, isn't it? I like that little cassette thing. It's kind of retro, isn't it? Oh, how very nice. Oh, I do hope that the video is picking this up. Is this the original soundtrack? Fantastic. Here we go, press X. Retro cassette. Options. Uh, game. Invert Y axis is usually on aim assist. I, all the, I'm leaving everything the way it is apart from uh, 
the invert y axis video film grain intensity oh, i don't know what the fuck that is um audio subtitles on yeah everything's up full uh i haven't put any of the dlc codes in so uh, literally this is uh, as i've said the first time that i'm playing this oh i love that sorry i'm a huge fan of the original film this game is what i've been waiting for but i never thought that uh even just the atmospherics coming through the headphones and stuff. Really fucking gripping already. Right, play game. I don't know what the f fuck the differences are. Play survivor mode challenges. I'm not interested. Ah, right, I can see it now. Play main campaign or whatever. start game head tracking on oh, i haven't got a camera right okay um no I'm, I'm kind of against being spied upon by uh the government so uh, obviously i'll turn that off it should be able to detect i'm not being funny it should detect that i haven't got a camera plugged in so why it's asking me that i don't know um <clears throat> the other thing i will say i do try my best to shut my gob whilst there's cutscenes on i don't want to speak over somebody but um if i do well tough shit go and buy the fucking game if you want to know what it's like noise detection off so what's what's noise detection then if i scream like a girl is it gonna fucking upload it or something and go ha 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 right let's put it on Tell you what, as I'm not a fan of making a game last any longer than I it really should, let's put it on easy. I learned that from uh, trying to play some of the Call of Duty games in the past, and you find it, I just I don't enjoy it as much if I feel like I'm doing the same thing over and over, which is ironic considering I've been playing Destiny and doing the same thing over and over for the past couple of weeks. But anyway, um, I'm sure you've gotten bored by now and you've skipped to this bit so i'm gonna oh for fuck's sake trust me you're not the only ones who wish i'd just fucking get on with it adjust the slider until the sieg sun logo is barely visible against the black background now then do i do that on my television screen or do i do it on the game capture software so that you can see ah there we are so if i go down one you don't see it at all if i go up one there it is and as you can see barely visible that's that's it confirm Oh, fucking come on. Is this what they call fucking next-gen technology?
Maybe you could suck my cock. Right, I think it's going to be safe now for me to talk for a little while. Did any of you eagle-eyed uh, viewers notice how fucking terribly laggy that video play was? I don't know if it's going to show up, uh, but trust me, it was on the console. It, well, it's not anything to do with YouTube. The It, it just looked like it was, it was struggling to play. Um... The game itself, oh, look at this, yes, yes, a little bit of a, pardon the pun, nod towards the original Alien film. Um, I, I don't know if this is going to be 60 frames per second. It's not going to be 60 frames per second for you, the viewer, the YouTube viewer. It's not going to be 60 frames a second, um, but... For me, I, I doesn't look like it is. There's a really fucking odd, weird way about it. Right then. I'm pressing all the buttons that doesn't... Oh, hang on. Ah, right. Ducking down, you have to press what I would normally call my melee, which is the, um, the R3 button, you know, when you press down on the thumb thing. Uh... There appears to be some sort of sumo wrestler with some fatty tits. Um, I'm just looking at the detail on the, the old style monitors, how grubby they look. Uh, you know, with uh, the way that these ships were supposed to be. You know, truckers up in space kind of thing. I don't... Ah, right. If you press the if you press L one and R one, it zooms in. Or I thought it did. That's a bit weird. Uh right. A pair of slippers. A single slipper there. There appears to be a slipper missing. I'm just looking for some sort of like Easter eggs. Whee! Yeah, that's cool, isn't it? How you just... Because that's what happens in real life, isn't it? You just fucking glide round on the floor like you're some sort of fucking Jesus. Um, War in Totality. Frank Herman. Don't even know if that's a real, uh, a real book. Some sort of games console thing there, is it? Or... What's that? Readers' wives, or hey, hey, here we go. Jazz mags. What's that? Lunar slag? Oh no, Lunar style. Fast craft. Okay, a pack of what appears to be gold cigarettes. Right. Okay. Ooh. That be that must be because I put it on easy, is it? <clears throat> right, I'll shut me gob in case there's any dialogue. <laughs> right, okay. Right. Do I sign in? Oh, look at that. I sign in on the one with my name. And it's, for some reason... It's not green. Right, let's look at the names. Verlaine. Uh, Taylor. Some sort of sumo wrestler fetish. Connor. Ooh, John Connor. Some sort of link to the Terminator universe there. Probably not. Um, 
whatever that is, and Samuels. All right, so let's guide me to the only green screen. So basically anybody who got hold of one of those cards can sign in as a Ripley. There's no thumbprint or retina form of identification. Objective up updated get dressed. I don't I don't wish to get dressed. I want to walk around naked. I do like the sound of bare feet on the floor. That's quite a clever little uh hang on. Right, I don't know if it's me or the, the perspective is off, but I kind of get the impression that when I'm walking towards this, I'm going to bang my head because of the way it... Look at the height of it compared to what, you know, my my field of view. Doof. Oh, like a, like what the fucking Stormtrooper in the original Star, uh, Star Wars film. Right, well, that door opened a bit too quickly for my liking. I don't mean I wanted it to take forever to open. I just meant as in... I'm yet to go down there. I, I, there's other places where the doors are, don't need to be opened, so I'm going to go and explore them first. I do like spaceship corridors. If I won the lottery... That's what I would do. I'd have a mansion and I'd build a, an underground uh, facility and I'd have space corridors like this. Right. Don't want to go in there. I'm going to have to be forced to talk to somebody if I do. My toes seem to have disappeared into the paper. And now my foot. It's like that back to the future where the guy's fucking arm goes starts going missing. Oh my god, look, my foot is this what the fuck is that? Oh my god. Right. Nitpicking aside. Um yeah, I, I don't know what it is. It's the field of view, perhaps. I just keep thinking I'm gonna bang my head. I should be walking around like this. Well, not like this, not some sort of midget or something, but... All right, we've been in there. This is the door that opened just now, so let's... Personal storage. Bit of a messy place, isn't it? Where, you know, you've got all this shit all over the floor. And people can't be bothered to fucking pick it up. More coffees, more fags. More bits of paper on the floor again. More disappearing feet. Right, the thing is, you probably won't pick up on the very sort of low, hey, jazz mag, um, frequencies and things like that in the game. Use registration points to manually save your progress. I didn't even fucking read that. Right, save game. Overwrite save data, yes. Verlaine, Connor. Ah, Ripley has the one with the green light on it. Get dressed. Let's do that then. Ah, I thought there was going to be a fucking alien in there then. Right. Woo! 
Look at my snazzy shoes. Thing is, is are there going to be any mirrors? Do I even know if I'm dressed, or am I going to be running around the ship with my tits out? All right, hang on. So when when it says use. I'm basically turning the screen on or off. Right, okay, all right then. Search. Take item, take all, scrap, scrap, scrap. Find blueprints to help you craft items from the components you collect. Okay, I have to be, read a bit quicker then, shall I? Maybe go back to school or something. Watasumi? Waylon Yutani? Yeah, 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 we all know about them. Siegson? Seekson Right. So I can't use it again then to get undressed. Okay, let's go and see what this does over here. Ooh. Oh, you know what? I'm not going to read it out. I'm not here to do that fucking shit um search search okay search i'm just gonna fucking take everything so you've got these cupboards you've got these overhead lockers that for some reason are able to detect that there's stuff inside them and put a light on Oh, actually, that was empty, but it had a light on. So the light, like you can't close it again now. You can only ever open these cupboards, but not close them. Yeah, that's that's right. OK, that's, I don't know what to fucking make of that. Caution wet floor. Ah, cool. Booted that out of the way. All right. Can I take a dump? No. Hey, shower, baby. Ah, oh, with my clothes on. There isn't even any water effects on the fucking screen. <sighs> right. Uh, oh, hang on. There's a cupboard I didn't search. Take everything. Right. She makes the, the proper old person noise when somebody crouches down. She goes, oh. Not every time, though. I quite like that. Oh, fuck. I'm like, shit. I better turn it back off. Conserve water and all that. So even though I've been in the shower soaking wet, there isn't any fucking droplets on the floor. Personal storage. Can't access any of them. The door's open. You know, I can't even fucking hell. This is, I don't know. I don't know if you're getting the same sensation just watching the video, but it just looks as if I'm too tall and there's no ducking down sensation going through the door. It's a bit weird. It's a little bit off putting. I don't know. Maybe they've just. Maybe they've accurately portrayed what it's like to be in a corridor whereby the top of your head just about nearly hits the, the ceiling, but it 
it's it's kind of weird. Right, so you can't you can only access cupboards that have lights on them. Oh, I don't want to talk to people. Right. Um yeah, chances are there's not going to be any alien encounter. Like the film, like the film itself, the original one, I don't think anything happened for the first hour. Anyway, but this is just gives you a kind of a rough idea. You know, this isn't a a fucking playthrough. This is just a first impressions, what it's like to put the disc in. Right, so he doesn't need to sleep as much sleep as the rest of us. So he's he's going to be some sort of fucking clone, uh, robot type thing. Then is he? He's obviously got some sort of agenda, and uh, you're going to have to battle with him later on or something. Okay. Please order more of above. Okay. Right, I guess I gotta go and talk to this woman then. I mean, admittedly, I didn't think I was gonna be put in at the deep end. I didn't think I was gonna battle the alien. I wasn't, you know, I'd be, I'd be kind of disappointed if I did, if I did battle the alien. Um, you know, within the first five minutes of putting the game in. Let's have some form of a. A story arc. Right. Um Um yeah, no shadow on the floor. Lighting's a bit crap. Um the mouth movement of the character didn't suit the words that were being said. A little bit cheap and tacky personally for me, I think, you know, a little bit more effort. Some sort of fucking blue hippo. Um, oh, I've just automatically climbed up on something. Another one of those game things. I mean, isn't this set 
when was this set? What year was this set in? Why do they have these game system things or whatever it is that look worse than the PlayStation Vita? Surely they would have had one of them by now. Here we go. Rock metal! On cassette! Doesn't quite seem right for the time and the year. Ooh, eat. <laughs> so there's, there's, yeah, there's some sort of thing that it just says eat. Ooh, look, bran flakes, corn flakes, and coffee. Right. Tomato ketchup. Okay. Milk, butter, cream, sugar. Porridge oats, bran flakes, corn flakes. Thank fuck it doesn't have Weetabix. Who the fuck eats Weetabix? Um, what part of my body almost hit that can over? Ah, uh, yeah, okay. Um, I'm starting to get that little bit of a decidedly underwhelmed feeling that I get sometimes when you look forward to something for so much. It's my fault. I overhype things in my own mind as to, uh, you know, how great things are going to be. And then when you get them, you're like, uh, okay. But I didn't make the mistake of getting the season pass this time. Um, you know, on day of release. Right, I'm sure reading all that kind of stuff is of interest to some people. I'm not one of those people, to be honest, especially when I'm not, you know, not really playing the game as such. Uh, possible dialogue up ahead, so um, I'll keep stum for now. I didn't I didn't collect anything. I didn't do anything. I just stood there. Oh, I didn't notice this. Outside. Uh, have I got to sit somewhere, have I? Oh, for God's sake. Where the fuck do I sit? Oh, I've got to get my documents, have I? Collect briefing file. <laughs> wow.
Well, I think anybody who's anybody knew that uh, Goggles Four Eyes was going to get fucking bumped off pretty soon. All right, back in my control now. Um, oddly enough, uh, when the previous thing was going on, I was waiting for it to... I was waiting for the right moment to turn around and say, yeah, Goggles Four Eyes is about to get killed. I thought she would be the one that perhaps uh, would see a face hugger get killed, be brought back on the other ship. Now, whether or not they are still alive and you meet up with them later on, I don't know. I think... That bloke, I don't know what his name was, but I believe he's probably a, a synthetic. He's probably going to be still alive because he can he can survive out in space, probably. Am I naked again? Oh, no. Right, find help. Okay, um, use registration points to manually save your progress. They will warn you if enemies are nearby. Well, if they've got that kind of intelligence, why can't they do something about the enemies and fucking lock them in a certain room? You fucking divs. So when it says it'll let you know that enemies are nearby, is it so that you don't save the game just before you're about to get your fucking head bitten off? All right. Hmm. Okay. Um, well, there's, you know, there's a shadow effect there. As you can see, it kind of glistening on the screen. How come there's no shadow when that woman was walking down the corridor then? Um, yeah, that does look kind of nice. I'll give it that. See if I can kick the sign into it. No, kick the traffic on. So I put the traffic on on my head. Um, so can I can I go around? So there's quite literally, as you can see, there's nothing stopping me from walking ahead. Apart from, do not go down this way. Let's funnel you in the right direction. Uh, I do quite like the heat effects, as you can see.
primary airlock. This is the way I came, isn't it? So nothing, nothing that way, right? Okay. So so if I can't go that way. Or is there something I haven't used? Oh, what? Have I got a... Oh, right, okay. I've got a crouch and then I climb in there. Um, do you know what? I, I did say earlier on that I'm decidedly underwhelmed. However, now it's, it's decidedly I'm, I'm, I'm beginning to feel a little bit more tense. Uh, like the cl the claustrophobia and and the lighting effects are kind of and the sound okay is this where you got to start reading about something and right it's not a playthrough so i'm not going to give you every bit of detail you can go and look at all that kind of stuff yourself i don't even know what that is we'll find out what that is at some point do, 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 do. where's the alien where's the alien why aren't you fighting the alien because it's fucking not there the whole point of this is to build up the tension. Well... Health and safety on that ship leaves a uh, leaves a lot to be desired, doesn't it? I suppose, in a way, then the original ship, the first ship that you're on, has to be kind of decidedly clean cut to give you that kind of now dirty claustrophobic dark dank scary kind of uh, you know feeling so so what am I doing now I pressed the duck button but now I, I appear to be laying on the floor am I Let's go and see what some of this rad graffiti is. Someone new. You always know working Joe. You always know a working Joe. Right. Forgotten F you. Strangers will be shot. No entry. Keep moving. All uh, not exactly the kind of motivational posters that you normally get in uh, working environments, but 
it's it's not also saying to me there is something on board this ship killing people watch out you know if that's what it's being aimed for if that's what you're supposed to get from this you know plain english you know stuff like that usually helps doesn't it um oh there's a ladder i didn't didn't notice that first time that's the one i crawled in through so let's go around here um ba -bum -bum -bum, ba -bum -bum -bum. you're gonna get your head bitten off right What's this? Oh, scrap. Okay. Ah, so there's no cassette in there then. It's just the radio. Even though you're pressing play, there's no cassette that's actually moving. So what is it you're playing? Because it doesn't look like there's a CD player, is it? It's little things like that that fucking really piss me off. Stupid attention to detail. Where's the fucking cassette? Yeah? Fucking hell, man. What was that? What was that? Collect sensor. Right, so if this is... If this is... Perhaps one way of going, let's go back down and have a look. What happens when you crawl through that um, that other area? Oh wow! What was that? Why why was that? Oh, it's because I'm in the light, and then you walk out of right. Okay, all right then. Tum -ti -tum -tum -tum. Okay, trip major event. Ah, this is what we're coming for. Some sort of collectible here, is it? Take all. Thank you. Well, that's obviously jammed. That's telling you you can't go this way. So I guess we've got to go all the way back, all the way back. All the way back. A light bulb with notes in it. The smart decision. Go fund investor. What's this? Everyone is responsible for sa safety. Right. One thing I would like to point out, though, at the very, very beginning of this, when you had that uh, Sigourney Weaver speech, which has clearly been re-recorded from this, and not, and not lifted from the, the end of the uh, original film, when she said, uh, Cain, uh, blah, 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 uh, Ash, Dallas, they're all dead, um, I'd like to technically point out Ash was never alive in the first place. What with him being a... What with him being a robot? Right. Now this is where I believe um, a lot of the gameplay is going to be. You gotta go to get. You gotta go to one area to turn on the power to come back through the same place the same way to go through a certain door. Um, is that a model of the ship? Uh, 
right okay i don't know what it is it just looks so very clean not very detailed are, are you getting what i'm getting at with the with the cables i don't know there's a picture of the fonds there e um right okay let's forgotten question mark f u trust no one keep out looters keep out looters will pay what the fuck right what does that say is that somebody's name why would you tag all the way up there why would you put a star all the way up there why that wall in particular why not write something by here then make the effort to go all the way up there to do it never mind um all right Use touchpad button to open the map. Okay. Tomorrow, no together future. Help. What? Welcome to the end of the line. Well, why would you write that sideways? Right there across. I, right, okay. This life for rent. Find a way to restore power to the shutter. So would that be the the thing that's flashing and making the noise? Yeah, yeah. Oh, what have I got to do now? Have I got to keep? Oh. Yeah, because. The thing is, I don't feel as if I'm fully interacting unless I'm pressing a button. You know. Sign in. Right, I'm not going to give away too much. I'm not playing too much. Let's save the game here. Um, yes, I do. <sighs> right, I, d I don't know what to say. It's coming up to about an hour now, and about that's that's about as much as I'm prepared to put into a to a video. When I first play something, I feel slightly underwhelmed. Yes, nice enough graphics ish for a next gen, or what I prefer to call current gen, because it is currently available. To me, next gen is the next generation uh, game console. That's a fucking terrible poster, isn't it? Regular dental checks, checkups are vital to the health of your teeth. Don't put them off. And then there's shotguns? Shells? Is that right? Oh, I, I, I'm just really not understanding this at all. Restore power. I thought I had. So I've come all the way to this door to find that there's no power. Yeah, 
enter passcode, don't have a passcode. Restore power. I thought I had restored power. Right, okay, all the doors are showing red lights, meaning you haven't done this yet. There's something else for you to do. Oh. Right. Was there something on you that said restore power? Oh, bloody hell. Right. Let's go and see where they are going to. Sorry, but the running does not feel like running at all. That just feels totally fucking clomping. Well, well, how did they fucking get through there then? What did they do? They closed the door behind them, did they? Without stopping to wonder who turned the fucking power on. Clomp, 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 clomp. Right, so I restored the power. Those two things opened. I can't go through there because I need a power something or other. Password, which is probably on the computer, which I'm refusing to go and back and have a look at. Let's run again. Clump, 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 clump. What's in this briefcase? Well, you can't open that. Um, every time I go into a new area, it seems to trigger this, let's shake the ship and let's make a bit of dust fall and let's make a few groaning, grinding, twisted metal noises that you've seen and heard a million billion times in sci-fi movies. Let's duck underneath this dangerously electrical cable. Again, same graffiti tomorrow together equals no future what all right i'll take a screenshot of that um yeah i'll go back i might post that up on uh Twitter. Clump, 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 clump. The thing is, I've got trainers on, but why does it sound like I've got fucking metal boots on? Door locked. Baggage claim. Forgotten FU. The same fucking graffiti over and over. Strangers will be shot. Oh, hang on.
Right, that was decidedly uh, not scary. I'm, I'm not going to use the word scary, but just okay. That was decidedly right. This is getting a bit. Why is every? Why are all the surfaces so clean cut? Look at it. It just looks so as if they've made no effort with the textures. It just seems kind of bland. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, another F U again. You always know a working Joe. I mean, really? Could you not just fucking come up with something else to write? Unless this is personal jokes. Cred op amusements. Okay, I wonder if there's any Easter eggs in there. We need help. Okay. When I say Easter eggs, I mean things like any alien arcade games. What's that called? Run around Rex. Okay. Ooh, what's this? A flare. Okay, a couple of air hockey tables. Use. Oh, see, this is the kind of thing that really does my tits in. Like, does it does it really make me feel like I'm twisting a a lever just because I I pump the X button? It doesn't make me feel. As if I'm interacting. It just makes me feel as if I'm playing fucking track and field. From the arcades years ago, you know. Hang on, why would an arcade game have a TV channel that was searching through channels? It's a monitor that displays a fucking game? How many of these do you have to scan before, uh, before it comes up with something? Right, okay, I'm going to be rounding this video up now. Is there somebody in there? Oh, hang on. Okay, that was made to make you think that there was something in you. Now, was it human? Was it alien? Who knows? Yeah. Okie doke. Right, I'm going to save this now. Ooh, open vent. Uh, I'm going to save it now. I'm going to call it a day on this video. You've seen as much as I'm prepared to sort of show you. I'm not going to do too much, you know, with regards to the spoilers. I'm not going to do an entire playthrough of the game. Uh, there you go. That My first impressions are a bit sort of <sighs> meh. I guess. Um, but we shall see as we progress. I can't give you an impression. I can't tell you what I think of the entire game until I've played the game. You know, I don't, I don't want to get into that. Uh, you know, I remember when I first started playing Killzone. Uh, if you'd asked me on the first day of playing Killzone what the game was like, I would have said, excellent, brilliant. Then 
when it comes to you know almost finishing the game i was so bored i i really wanted to just remove my eyes with a spoon i just could not be bothered it was it was a fucking chore to finish um this i i just feel a bit underwhelmed by it you know it's not the amazing uh oh it's going to be this it's going to be that i mean the way that they're running around the clump 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 kind of just i don't know i just don't feel as if i'm getting much submersion into it i guess i don't know maybe i haven't just given it enough time but that's that's the whole idea of these first impressions uh the one man rambles it's well i know they say first impressions last it's uh yeah okay I, f I finally got the game and i guess i'll get round to playing it but uh it doesn't appear as if i'm going to get overly excited about playing it and in fact i'm going to turn it off now and play some more destiny and do a bit of a grind and uh try and get some points on that there you go alien isolation about an hour's worth of me playing it um i i really don't know what else to say to be honest 